I just have some content I need to upload. And then I have to take out all the garbage. My mom, my little brother turned 11 on Sunday. Today's the 13th. So on the 11th, we had a barbecue for my brother and uh, my mom fell coming out the backyard. I look crazy and broke her foot in two places. So she's waiting for surgery because they have to put screws in so that it heals straight. So she's awaiting surgery. So that's just been hectic. Also, I'm raising a dog and just trying to get him potty trained and used to his new life. That's been really exhausted. I've neglected myself um, and all my responsibilities because he's taking over a lot of it. And just really trying to get him down into a routine because when I go back to work, it's just, I would like for things to be structured. I work off of a schedule and it just works that way. So I'm just trying to get him into a routine. But today I have so much to do, clean up my house. I have to go and get some stuff on the road. Um, I have to go to the mall. Do I have to go to the mall? I have to go to Home Sense for doggy wipes for him. He's so cute. I have to go get dog wipes. Do I have a list? I have to go to shoppers. Um, and then I need shoppers for and pimple patch. And I need a coffee. I need a strong coffee. I love my Keurig, but I need it to be a little stronger. I think I'm gonna just go back to instant. It's just that the... The Keurig just doesn't give it that kick that Starbucks does, hence why I'm always spending so much money. But I have a video that is done. I just need to add two clips and then I can upload that to YouTube. It's gonna go up before this one and then I'll put this one up. Um, and then I have some content to shoot for YouTube, for Instagram and TikTok. And I also have um, extremely grateful because there's a company that I'm working with on TikTok, which is wild. I have 70 followers on TikTok and it's not that much and a company that when they were launching I was extremely excited because the concept of their brand was just different and I feel like a lot of people nowadays are coming into the makeup world but it's just doing the same thing just adding their name to it but this brand really did something different and I'm extremely intrigued by the fact that they want me to do something for them because that'll make no sense I've been really working hard on my content, my reels on Instagram. I've really taken what Ed Sheeran said about Instagram, where for him it's a business platform. I don't share my life on Instagram anymore. I don't take pictures. I don't do any of that. Instagram is to promote. So my makeup stuff is what I'd like to promote. And then everything for my YouTube is always linked. My TikTok is linked. Instagram is work. It's not a place to be social because I feel like any time that I was or was posting my life, I was always judged. I had so much negativity coming from just me living my life. So I saw a clip of Ed Sheeran said he promotes his music on Instagram. He doesn't post pictures of his kids or any of that. Um, and I do that with YouTube. If you guys want to see my life, you watch me on YouTube. If you want to see the things that I'm working with, the brands that I'm working with, you can head over to my Instagram or TikTok, but I'm going to try and disassociate my real life with Instagram because it's just negative. Pop Smoke got killed because he posted his address on Instagram. PND Rock posted that he was at, his girlfriend posted that they were at. Roscoe's waffle, chicken and waffles, and ended up dead. Like, it's just, it's not a place where you, no. It's just not a friendly place. But I did edit some videos, and I do wanna upload them to Instagram. So I'm gonna post those content, and then I'm gonna finish cleaning, and then I'm gonna shoot some more content, and then we're gonna hit the road.
my hair now. So let's see how this goes. girls that love them some eco styler i've been uh, well i was watching way too much tiktok and i saw people add water to their eco styler when it's running low and then mix it up so it can become more and i had about this much left and i added water and it literally thickened up i'm gonna do it again because if that means like here let me see that's the water. I'm trying to like skim the top so I can grab the water, but interesting. A water-based gel, any water-based gel, I'm pretty sure this can happen. Any water-based gel, add some water, mix it up, and uh, you get more gel. Interesting. And now, that is one less thing on my list I have to buy. Crazy. I'm gonna film my makeup. So I'm going to film, and then we're gonna hit the road. I'm dressed. for a lip combo. I want to do something pinky because I'm wearing all black. My pants are black. So I'm trying to think of what lip to do. I don't want it to be too nude. Maybe we'll do nude because we can't stick in there. So I might do, I forgot I had this. It's an interesting texture. Ooh, and I got this new scent. It is I literally just like popped in. But I got this new scent. It's called the Vanilla Sky by Skylar. Yeah, it, anything vanilla I love. So I bought the travel size just to see how I like it. If it runs out, I always buy the big one. I'll just get the big one. But really excited about the scent. The keynotes are cappuccino, pure vanilla, caramelized, Cedar. Okay, let's go finish this video off and then I'll show you my OOTD. My top is from Ritzy, I think it's the Babaton. Then I'm wearing my local European pants. My local European pants, super comfortable. I have my headphones on, so I don't know if I'm being loud. I'm wearing my black chucks. My bag. And we're out. We're back. I... Majority of the things that I needed, I got some doggy wipes, I got a satin pillow for my boyfriend, and then 
I picked up some Tupperware from my boyfriend's grandmother because I threw hers out. And then I got the Jersey. And then I went to the grocery store. There's been this recipe online at this place that I go to for smoothies. And I make the green one this morning, but there's another one called Almond Brothers from IQ. So I got all the ingredients for that, which is what I'm gonna make. Picked up a salad, some rice crisps, more stuff for the smoothie. And then I picked up the pumpkin spice latte, um, almond and oat non-dairy. I also got these make good uh, um, crisp squares and the biscuits. These are actually really good. Okay, so the ingredients are almond butter. I'm just mixing it up because it's separated. I don't have any ingredients. I'm literally just gonna eyeball this. Banana. And then I'm gonna put 10 almonds. I got shredded coconut. And then dates. One, two, three. Update on the smoothie, it's perfect. It just needs to be cold. All right, six. salad because I don't want to cook this one is the strawberry almond goat cheese salad I don't want to cook but I still have so much work to do so poured it into a bowl and I'm gonna use a little chipotle ranch I chosen this stuff is so good Bun 